Hi Tom, how you doing? Hi, how are you? Good. A couple questions. Um, how do you describe yourself as an artist? Uh, I guess first I would consider myself a painter. As far back as I can remember I've been painting and uh, I am still doing it today and I consider myself today an encaustic portrait painter. And as a professional artist, what do you think of contemporary art? Do you intend to create new works in other forms? Uh, first, let me say, all artists have to create. That's what art is about. And uh, so, yes, I'm constantly looking for other areas to create in. Uh, I have recently worked in uh, black and white photography and jazz uh, music and developed photonality, which is a visual form of music uh, with the still camera, and I've uh, developed them into uh, book format. Um, what inspires you as a human and an artist? Uh, first, what inspires me as a human uh, is the fact that we're finding out more and more as we keep getting advanced is that uh, we're all connected. There's a underlying link which connects us all and uh, whether it's through some part of our DNA or whatever but we are all linked together and um, this can be seen especially with twins and uh, how the inner workings go between both of them uh, but each of us, whether we are related or not, we're all connected. And to survive, we all must realize this and treat each other like that. Which work of yours do you consider a masterpiece? Hmm. Uh, if I had to look at the entire body of work, uh, and the first thing that would come to mind would be probably the Magdalena portrait with... Uh, Ashley Olson, and basically uh, why I said Magdalena portrait is because it is very simple, it's very simple portrait work, uh, it is just a young girl glancing over her shoulder, and it's just a quick glance, but what that quick glance does, it asks the three basic questions, you know, who, what, and where, and they're the questions of our existence, it's when you look at the painting, the first thing you say is, who is this? You know, what is she doing? You know, what is she looking at? What's happening? And where is she? Where is she going? Where is she from? You know, these are things that Gauguin and many other artists have tried to incorporate into their work. And I guess this piece does it the most for me, speaks the most to me. And so, if I was to call it a masterpiece, this would have to be one of the, one I would say it brings to my, comes to mind. And uh, what do you hope people would say about you after you die? Uh, good things. <laughs> now, what, uh, really what I hope they would uh, say more about my art, because that's what I am all about, and uh, I hopefully come through my art. Uh, hopefully I'm seen within my work. Uh, like I said, I work mostly in portrait work and in caustics, and this format dates back to the uh, Fayum Egyptian artists some 2,000 years, and I hope that my work will go the distance and last a couple thousand years, and that generations and generations from now people will ask those amazing three questions who is this what are they doing where are they going where are they from the questions of existence and that's what I hope my work will 
give to somebody and when they see it and they stand in front of one of my pieces and they look into the eyes or the face or the expression, they'll walk away asking those questions. Okay, thank you. Thank you.